I love to make pancakes simply because it puts a huge smile on my kids' faces. It's always a special morning when I make them. Well, today I'm going to make buttermilk blueberry. These are the ultimate. Hey guys, I'm Shereen with Cook This. First to get started on our blueberry buttermilk flapjacks or pancakes. Actually means the same thing. I like to say flapjacks. I have two eggs in a bowl. We're just gonna whisk them and then add all of our wet ingredients. So we have our buttermilk and melted butter that I melted earlier. And then you just wanna let it cool so that way it doesn't scramble the eggs. And the butter is actually a magic ingredient in these pancakes. It gives them a little crispness around the border. That's the magic ingredient. Our buttermilk. So I've made this recipe so many times and I've realized it's pretty much foolproof. Although right now I'm adding the wet ingredients whisking them together, and now we're gonna add the dry ingredients a little at a time. I've done dry ingredients to the wet ingredients, wet ingredients to dry ingredients, and it still works out. It's pretty much foolproof. Just clear my area. Okay, so we have all-purpose flour, some sugar, Again, it helps the pancakes to just develop that little crisp texture. Some baking soda so they get light and puffy. And some salt. Salt always, it just brings everything together. Now I'm just gonna add the dry ingredients a little at a time into our wet ingredients. Whisk it together and then we're gonna let the batter rest. So that way we can have a nice and tender cake for about 15 minutes. So our batter has rested about 15 minutes. Now you just wanna add and fold in the blueberries. You just wanna make sure they're really dry so that way it doesn't dilute our batter. This is nice and fluffy. All right, so my griddle is heated. So you just wanna take a little bit of canola oil, drizzle it right over your griddle, or you could obviously do this in your nonstick skillet. And now, this is gonna make a lot of pancakes. My son, Costas, which I'm not allowed to say his name. He doesn't want me to tell you his name. Anyhow, my son <laughs> loves these. He says they taste like blueberry muffins. They have that cake-like quality. We just want the border to set. Little bubbles break the surface, about two minutes on each side. So a great tip, this batter will make a lot of pancakes. And with my kids back to school, they like to start their morning off just right. Nothing better than a pancake breakfast. So here's what I like to do. Take the pancakes, let them cool, individually wrap them in parchment paper, and then place them in a large freezer zipper bag. Into the freezer they go. When it's time for breakfast in the morning, individually take them out, put them on a dish in the microwave, one, two minutes, they're back to life, and there is your breakfast. So this is the last of the pancakes. I'm gonna save these tomorrow for school, wrap them up, but these we're gonna eat right now. I actually like to eat them just like a cake. Mmm. They're so light and fluffy. For this recipe, go to the newspaper's website and follow me on Facebook and Twitter for more culinary tips. I'm Shreem with Cook This. Thanks for watching. See you next week.